Well, I'm actually really excited about the new space. What we have done is we've expanded the waiting room. Um, there was always a sort of back door in the waiting room that they probably never used that led over to our contact lens department. Well, we added four exam rooms there, and that's where uh, the extra pediatric ophthalmology space is. Um, and this was all done so that uh, to accommodate Dr. Woodward, who is the second pediatric ophthalmologist who joined us in June. Um, if people have not been to a pediatric eye room before, there are some differences from going to other eye clinics. Um, one of them is that uh, our rooms are a lot longer than the others. Um, and that's because that's very important for measuring how the eyes line up. It turns out that if you're in a room that, uh, say, has a series of mirrors to make things look as though they're 20 feet away, your brain knows that, that they're looking at mirrors and they actually do a little bit of uh, what they call accommodation. Your eyes actually will pull in a little bit. So to get an accurate measurement, you really need a long room. So that's one of the first differences. Some of the features that are different than if you were just going to an adult ophthalmologist are uh, the equipment we have set up in order to try and get children to fixate across the room. So we do have uh, toy animals that have been wired with a foot pedal that they'll do some sort of animated activity. Um, and then uh, our eye chart itself uh, has a setting that will show uh, animals. Um, they'll cycle through like an, an elephant and a dog barking and a rabbit. And then we also have a, a television where we just show movies uh, so that we can get the children to stare across the room uh, so that we can uh, obtain the measurements we need. Uh, for quite some time I've been the only pediatric ophthalmologist in northeastern Wisconsin. There's nobody north of us and um, so unfortunately I had a large backlog of patients and there really was a greater demand than I could satisfy. I was at a point where I was scheduling more than a year in advance and so what's going to be really beneficial to patients is that they now don't have to wait an inordinately long time to come in but also with having a second pediatric ophthalmologist we can actually do the exams quicker so there's less waiting time when they're here which is huge because it was a major frustration for them and for us. And certainly just scheduling, when I'd say I want to see them again, uh, that was problematic and now that problem is solved.